is getting spicy up in here. Turns out Monica was inside the blimp. Didn't see that coming. But I probably should have guessed it because that's like, you know, why the whole age thing jumped. But yeah, 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 yeah. But they kill off her mama, which is not cool. Not cool at all. That that hurt my heart. But Maria, she was part of making sword. So it's like, what? And Hayward, I don't like that dude. I do not like this dude. He might be a good guy. I don't know. But my spotty senses are tingling. And I say that this man is low-key bad. I don't know what. I don't know what he is going to do. But I say bad. Bad, I say. They bought Mr. Woo back. Mr. Woo. I just wonder where Eddie's at. Because, you know, Eddie. I don't know where Eddie's at. But they bought Mr. Woo back. Which is really cool, you know. Because, you know, he was from Ant-Man. He's the one. That voice cracked, though. And I was talking on the radio. And I don't know how I didn't, you know, know from his voice because I'm pretty good at that. Jimmy Woo's been working on his magic tricks. So the toy helicopter that we saw in the first uh, two episodes turns out to be the drone that Monica was flying in the fourth episode. So we have Darcy back, which is really awesome. She's my favorite character. And then it turns out that she was the one that was taking notes at the end of the first episode. This whole Franklin guy? I don't know, man. I don't know how I feel about this dude. Because like I said before, I already think that Hayward dude was bad. And this Franklin dude, how come when he passes through the, um, the um, I guess you could say the radius line or, you know, the portal, whatever you want to call it. How come he turns into the B person? You know what I'm saying? Why? 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 I don't know why. Why? Do you know why? Who knows? But what if that's because that's his true identity? He swarm. You know what I'm saying? He the beekeeper. Who else could it be? Because you're telling me all of a sudden, coincidentally, that he turns into a B person? Like, like throughout everything he can then turn into, he turns into a B person. Like, Mmm, really now? So with the whole hexagon being a little teaser and that if it could be Sinister Six, if you look at way Spider-Man Far From Home ended, Mysterio came out and called out Spider-Man and letting everyone know that it was Parker Peter. So then that just shows you right there that the Sinister Six could all team up to try to kill that man. Now, when I should have thrown me into next week, I did it me literally. <laughs> with, with Wanda able to throw Monica out and then put the whole house and fence back together, that just shows you she's way stronger than she was the last time we saw her at um, the end of Endgame. And on top of that, you see how we saw Vision, how he really, how he's really supposed to be looking like? Like, I don't know about you. But that scared me, okay? That scared me, the way he looked. Like, look, look at that. Look at that. That's not normal, cuz. That's not normal. And then we have Vision saying, Wanda, we could go anywhere we want. And she says, no, we can't. That just right there, that shows you that because they have to stay in that area because that's her little reality that she's making. And then she tells him that this is her home now. Hinting again. That it was all Wanda. 